pasta. Yes, you heard it right. Spanish garlic. And um, this is the first time I'm using it. You're the last one. Complete the mission. Yo, what's up? It's your boy X in Mexico. And welcome back, my boys, to another video and another recipe in X in Mexico kitchen. And today, my boys, we are doing Spanish garlic pasta. Yes. You heard it right, Spanish garlic pasta. With few ingredients, all you need to make this pasta. So without further ado, let's dive in. Catch face, and I'm gonna tell you what do you need ingredients for this recipe. Let's do this. Yeah, baby, let's go, my boys. Here we have the vape. Obviously, someone, let me have someone, and we're gonna start by cutting the zucchini. We're gonna start by cutting the zucchini. Top of the head. The shit. And we're gonna cut them like this. Then we're gonna put them like this and put them like this, like this and like that. Like this and like that. I think one is enough, my boys. I don't know, I have to see. Okay, so the zucchini will be like this. You know, in four sheets. Let me remove the garlic for now and let me put the zucchini in the bowl, in the bowl or bowl, what the fuck ever you call it. La scudella. See, no, no, see. Okay. La ciotola or la scudella. Come cazzo dici. See, no? Okay. I'm doing this for three people. I was going to continue talking in fucking Italian, you know? Like this and like that. And like this and like that. No, let's actually do one more. One more cooking. One more. Because, you know, for three people, it's different. So the onion is not going to be fine cut. Let me remove this shit. Let me cut this like this. And like that. Obviously, be careful of your fucking finger. Now let me bring the cheat sheet right here. So first you need to put, let, let the heat, I will tell you, I will tell you when it will come, when it will come, I will tell you. Just let me cut the shit, so. Cut the shit again, here we have the nice zucchini. Yo, it's a fucked up shit. 
that you go to a green grocer to buy this shit and they don't know what zucchini is. You know, they say marrows, I say no, they are fucking different. These are zucchini. But they are different from the marrows, you know. For me, they make different tastes. I don't know for you. But for me, they make different tastes, my geez. My boys. Oh, the bowl is full. My bowl is overflowing, my geez. Thank the good Lord Almighty for this food. Every day, single day. Thank the good Lord Almighty that you have fucking food on your table. Woo! So now let's cut the onion. So the onion is going to be like this. One, two, still not fine cut. I'm not gonna do fine cut. Oh my shit. Okay, then we're gonna do like this. Okay, you know, you can do it. But I'm watching the phone if it's out of focus or not, and I have to cut the onion. So, that is why. Let me have one onion. Yo, the, this shit, what the fuck is it? The saffron? It's expensive as fuck, my boys. And I'm, this is the first time I'm using it. You know, but... Let me remove just the shit. Because I think the cut of the shit is doing the shit. Okay. Let me grab the shit. Okay. 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 Now we have the onions ready. Okay, let me cut the bell peppers, but first, let me not take a selfie, but a sip of red wine, it's a mellow, you know, you push this, pause, open it and that's it that it will remove okay let me wash it on you know so it will can remove the seed from the shit Okay, so now that we washed it, we can cut it in like this. Don't cut it in small pieces. Maybe cut it in, you know, like this, and like that, like this, and like that. You know, damn, I think I need another one, you because know, for three people, so. Yep, I'm gonna do the other one. Because I bought two just in case and thank the good Lord Almighty. Yo. Okay, so let me grab the other one. 
real quick. And apparently do the same like this. I will be back at you all for the parsley and the garlic. So we are my boys as usual. And we have a sip of wine. Here we have the bell peppers and the onion. Here we have the wine and we're gonna start cutting the garlic. You know, like this. That's how I'm going to cut the garlic. Like this. Let me show you. Just let me focus and like this. And like this. You see? Like that. Because this is a Spanish garlic pasta. You know the main ingredient is obviously garlic. So it has to taste like garlic, right? And you keep cutting the garlic like this. I'm gonna and the parsley. You're gonna find chop the parsley, my boys. So I'll be back with you when I come for the parsley, because it will take a long gas time. So now, my boys, that we have the that we have the garlic ready. We're gonna remove. Just come here and remove the garlic to our side. And you want to fine chop the shit. Just wash the parsley. We're gonna grab the shit and fine chop the shit. Fine, chop that shit. Parsley is done, fine chopped parsley is done. Now it's time to come on top and see what we have to do. Now we have to heat the let me we have to heat the olive oil and I'm gonna show you in a bit my Just a second. Some good ass wine you Oh yeah, my boys, now that you see the part when we cut the shit, here we have the fresh parsley, the garlic, the zucchini, the bell peppers with the onion. Now we're gonna start here by heating the pan. On medium flame. We're gonna let it heat when we let, when the oil, when the oil is heated we wanna put the bell peppers, the onions and the zucchini. See you in a bit. So now my boys we are going to start by putting the the bell peppers and the onions. The zucchini. And we're gonna mix them. Where the fuck is my spoon? 
medium heat and you're gonna leave it for five minutes after five minutes we're going to put our garlic but but until then I'm going to cover it up no. Keep mixing constantly. No, put all the onion because I don't put all the shapes. After five minutes, you need to put the garlic. And then when you put the garlic, you're gonna leave it for another minute. So Leave it for five minutes. So. Let's cover it up. So now come with me. And my boys, we're gonna do the vegetable stock. It says 600 milliliters of vegetable stock. Here I have this stock or vegetable broth, preferably, you know. Well, if you can find here, it is what it is. This cup holds 250 milliliters of shit, so we need to put two and a half. So that's one. That's two. Three and to the foam. And that's it. So now what you need to do is mix your vegetable stock. You, you might put some more, you know. So this is 600 milliliters of vegetable broth or vegetable stock. Let's get here to 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 mix the shit. Calibrate the pot. This is a one pot pasta. Like this. Like I did with the tuna. I'm gonna do with this. So let's leave it for five minutes. I will be back with you when I'm going to put the garlic and the shit. See you in a bit, my boys. So now, my boys, that the five minutes passed, we're gonna put the garlic. And we're gonna mix for another minute. Then we're gonna put the tomato juice, the parsley, and the chicken stock or the chicken broth. You know, so it will get it will infuse. The garlic will infuse with the ingredients. You know what I'm saying? So let's leave it for a minute and I will be back with you in a sec, my G's. See you in a bit. So now, my boys, we are going to put a minute has passed. We are going to put our tomato juice. You know? Open the sheets. Oh my god. Low flame. 
the other button that we say Now the policy that we have and the chicken or the vegetable stock or vegetable broth. Obviously, while the pasta will be cooking in this, you need to put more water you need to put more water obviously we're gonna cover it and let it come to boil when it will come to boil we're gonna put our pasta inside my bus. So I'm gonna see you when it will be ready and I will put the pasta. So now my boys it's time to put some saffron. Saffron. This is it I told you, yo, it's not a bag of 420. Gonna put some saffron like this. And we're gonna give it a mix. So when it will, will, will when it will start boiling, when we'll put the pasta in. The pasta will take that, it will absorb the juice of all this goodness, my dear. See you when I am about to put the pasta. See you in a bit, my boys. So now, my boys, I'm going to put the pasta. For two people. I think we need just a bit more, but we're gonna leave it like that. For now, we're gonna leave it like that. And let the pasta cook, you know, on medium flame. You know, you might need to add water, you know, to this fucking recipe, sorry about that, my geez. But let's see my boys, we're gonna leave it for about six minutes. Six minutes on high flame. Fuck this shit. See you in a bit. So yeah, here we are my boys with the final results of the Spanish garlic pasta. These are the final results. Look at that creaminess. Look at that shit. Look at here, here, here. Look at this cream. And these are the final results, my boys. So yeah, please, that was it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. That was the Spanish garlic pasta. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and hit notification bell right down below so you won't miss any of my cooking videos. Also gameplays and also reviews that I do. 
every single fucking day in this channel. I hope you're enjoying everything I do all for you. Because I don't get any money of this. So I'm doing this for everybody. That's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please thumbs up, subscribe, and all this shit. Thanks for watching. Share my video. Comment right down below what you play and cook next or review, right? It's your boy XD Max Cal. Please! And we're gonna say it together in 3, 2, 1. Bon appetito, bitch! 10 David to entry team. Your mission's complete. Good job. Head back to talk.